Hartley, welcome to Gurudeva online classes. This is Sitesh, 9th standard students in your uh, English language subject. Previous class we discussed about uh, the Song of Freedom poem, introduction and uh, about the author. In introduction, introduction says inspiration of freedom. There, there were many sources that many sources inspired to do the fight against uh, British rule. So, few people inspired by poems, few people inspired by stories, few people inspired by sacrifice, sacrifice of letters, uh, uh, and then struggling. These are all the sources inspired to freedom and we got to we get the freedom by the effort of those freedom fighters and then after getting the freedom how we will feel that feel completely explained and also how we were under the control of the British rule the complete concept to the complete theory morality it explained in this poem students now I read and uh, explain poem. This is the hour of song and dance for peaceful freedom. He is ours at last. Yes, uh, students, in this paragraph, what it explained in the sense here, it completely explained when we got a freedom, then how Indians were. Feel the feel feeling concept of uh, Indians when Indians had got a freedom. We cannot explain students uh, when we got the freedom and uh, when we rescue, when we uh, overcome the problems of uh, British rule. It was very completely uh, happy feelings. It comes when we got the freedom because many. <laughs> Freedom fighters sacrifice their life, and then many uh, freedom fighters uh, dethroned by British uh, administration. They hurried to the Indians, they killed the Indians, and uh, struggle was completely inspired. And many days struggle. Finally, that the effort gives uh, fruitful uh, result in the sense here we got freedom. How we feel in the sense here, the feeling concept cannot be explained. Very joyful uh, feelings we had at, uh, at that time when we got a freedom, when we uh, overcome the burden of the British rule. This is the concept says here, students here. See that hour when we got a freedom, that hour we cannot explain. That very completely happy feeling, joy, joyous, joyful concept we had at that time. That hour says when we got the freedom, that hour cannot be explained. It was like that. It is completely out. So people, when we got the freedom, the Indians completely they sing a song, enthusiastically sing a song, and then they did the dance celebration. The celebration cannot be explained. The celebration, how they made in the sincere singing a song, uh, dance, and then for blissful freedom. Why did they sing a song? Why did they did the dance in the sincere? Because blissful freedom. The freedom, it is completely common word freedom. We cannot, we cannot be uh, excited. So when we have the word blissful, what kind of the freedom we got is here blissful freedom we got here the blissful uh, what it says synonyms of the blissful is joyful peaceful we had the extremely happy the happiness we cannot be explained uh, that kind of the feelings we had that hour when we got the freedom so extremely happy shown by the indians by singing a song and uh, did the dance and uh, is ours at last. So our final freedom 
we get a freedom and uh, that freedom concept feel very happy finally we got a uh, freedom that when we got the freedom completely the blissful uh, feelings uh, expressed by indians because many days they were under the uh, british rule and finally we got the freedom that feelings cannot be explained the feelings how they expressed in sincere community singing a song and uh, doing the dance by celebration of uh, getting of a freedom this says in this uh, parallel students next one gone are those days of caste war pride gone is the foreigner's might gone is passive subservience gone is the trickster's sway very difficult words uh, students here passive the subservience and uh, trickster's sway this is the word used to identify the british how they were ruled in our india okay as yes, uh, gone or uh, gone all in this year we should understand passed away went went out those days because we got a freedom when we got the freedom those uh, cruelers administration cruelers uh, um, what the whatever the Uh, experience on um, indians the complete experience uh, gone away went out so gone are those days of caste born pride so here you the caste born pride pride is here they had the pride who in the sense here they had the pride of british people they had the pride that is the casteism born pride in this here so those uh, white people they were the superior like uh, they ruled in our india so they were the superior says here caste born uh, pride those in english people those uh, anglo uh, anglo people those british people they thought uh, their caste and their uh, color the community superior that says here that superior char- superior characteristics went out gone is the foreigner's might so which one went in the sense here we are another concept went out by the uh, british when we got freedom when we got freedom the might foreigners might foreigners in the sense here those cruelers uh, british people british administration british power it had gone away so your might in the sense here the power of british when we got a freedom the complete the power of administration the power of uh, british rule completely went out this says here and uh, gone is passive subservience see this is one uh, passive subservience in the sense here so inactive under rule who are the inactive under rule in the sense here we were the passive when the administration of the british rule we were the passive when the administration of the british rule that passiveness says here we were the inactive no activeness we were inactive while the while ruling period of the british that service subservience the completely under rule we were the under rule of british then we were how being in the sense here we were completely inactive concept we had that time okay and uh, the concept uh, inactive concept uh, uh, went out when we got abroad gone is the trickster's sway strict trickster's sway so here is trick the trickster's uh, sway in the sense here those people are cruelers cruel cruel rule cruelers who completely went out when we got a freedom because the effort of freedom fighters we got a freedom singing a song this is singing a song we got a freedom students by the great effort of freedom fighters we should be remember those freedom fighters because they sacrificed their life and we now completely we had a complete equality freedom and whatever the advantages whatever the facilities we are getting the completely the blessing of those freedom fighters we should be remember them because they wouldn't be fight against british rule what will happen in sense here still we were under the control of the british so no freedom no equality no facilities we completely under the dictators of uh, british rule so we should be uh, grateful to those uh, freedom fighters
So another one thing gone, gone away. Gone is a dictus sui. Cruella's uh, administration, sui in sincere rule, uh, rule went out when we got a freedom. Is this here, students? And then freedom is our universal speech. Equality, the experience, the grace. We will blow the cons of victory and publish the truth to all. See, effort, this paradox is, effort cannot be used. If we had effort, there will be a fruitful result. If, in your studies, if you put the effort, one day you get a good mass. That effort uh, uh, always bring in success. So here, effort who made success here? British, against British rule, our freedom fighters, what they had done, they completely put the effort, struggle a lot, the effort and struggle here, finally they got the fruitful result, we got a freedom, if this says here. So freedom is our universal speech. So motherland, our nation, this is the field that says here, freedom, it is universal, quite common. This is one truth are real. The universal is here. True or real concept of being a one country person, a freedom it completely is only. Equality in the experience and grace. So equality, freedom, when we born in our motherland, whatever, wherever the person born in their motherland, the motherland gives him to freedom, equality. That is one grace, that is one blessing of uh, motherland. And we will blow the pounds of victory. So this is the feeling, uh, sharing, how to express their feelings, feel when they got a uh, freedom. So that, that is says here, we will blow the pounds of victory. See the cones in sense here, the shell of a sea animal. The shell of a sea animal which produces a sound when you blow into it may be temple worshipping time using this uh, instrument to blow the sound that uh, when we got the freedom the peoples share their uh, feelings dance song and uh, blowing the cones of victory and then finally publish the truth to all so publishing truth to all is here a truth is effort struggling it was the truth Finally, we got a freedom that universal to explain our publishers. So we want to be saying to them, final effort, we got a freedom. This says in this paragraph. We see that all are equal born now lie and decide are dead. Only the good man are great. Ruin has seized the wicked. So, this paragraph, what it says in the students here. See, we see that all are equal born. When we got a freedom, then we got the concept of this uh, equality. So, equal born. So, Indians, one people to another people, one person to another person. We didn't get uh, equality concept when the, under the rule of British because in India few people supporting to the British. So in case how when they supported to the British, what happens here? We didn't care. We didn't war in the same nation because they war in India and supporting to the British. They were the traitors. We give for a name for them traitors cheating to the nation so that kind of the inequality concept had in uh, India when under the British rule when we got freedom so everyone uh, got an equality a freedom that says we see that all are equal born when we got the freedom this is, that is one kind of having equality no now lie and uh, decide are dead so liars, British people, those were the liars cheating to Indians, the, those were the frauds. Decide in sincere meaning, decide meaning is fraud, synonyms, fraud, 
concept of fraud characteristics so they had because by saying lie they acquire india publicly and they miss the rule in our india only the good men are great so indians are great here good men in sense here indians indians are completely great by uh, removing the administration power of british rule by great effort of our freedom of fighters ruin has seized the wicked so seizing so ruin in the sense of remaining remaining it completely seized wicked in the sense here wicked me uh, cruelers so cruelers complete administration clear the cruelers concept uh, completely what happened when we got freedom in sense the completely seized by indians by doing the struggle to tetra uh, mount or sent out to foreigners from our india this says meaning of this paragraph students next paragraph honor to the flowman and the worker see our uh, great india is completely agriculture land and uh, villages more villages it has and then main occupation of uh, india it is uh, agriculture so we should be respect to the farmers here flow man farmers and then workers working in uh, different fields different factories we should be respect for them we should be honor to the those people by saying this paragraph here shame to the glutton and wreck see british here poem the poet uh, says two uh, words how they were british how they were is there it was shame to them shame to the glutton and uh, the wreck see here glutton the uh, glutton synonym is here swallow uh they had the concept of greediness greedy eater so we say the greedy eater those uh, british were so they used here word glutton swallow just they swallowing all those our administration our land so our money a uh, complete uh, swallow by the british uh, that there was a shame for them shame to the glutton and the wreck wreck and since yes uh, see students uh, wreck uh, uh gambling so here given the meaning of wreck one who behaves in an immoral way though there is no moral way they have the immoral way those were the gambling those were the drinking so wreck uh, people it was a shame for them it says that line students only the good men uh, well not water we will not water the waste lands not sweat for the idlers we see by struggling against the british rule it says we will not water the wasteland see how much water you will be flow on wasteland they couldn't be get any uh, good result that is waste waste so the administration of british rule it was a waste we will not uh, water the wastelands this is a wasteland in desert and uh, we have desert in sense here british people one kind of a desert and then now uh, now sweat for the idlers we see idlers we in sense here uh, lazy power they have the we well be progress uh, another meaning of the we so idlers we idlers lazy power progressing in our india we didn't we no way we are not we, we were not giving any uh, path any way to those misrule doing administration people as a british we will not water the waste lands not sweat for the idlers we so see they didn't uh, sweat without uh, effort yeah without effort without the sweat uh, uh they getting the money by beating burdening to the indians they got the money here so we were not giving any respect for them there is no way to the lazy persons it says uh, that sentence students
So last paragraph of uh, what it says students here. We have learned that this is our own land. It will be forever ours. No nation shall enslave us again. We will prosper serving God, our sole Lord. So we should be remembering this concept student. So we have learned. See when we under the British rule, when we struggle, when we got this concept we should be learned. That is the our own land. So our land, our motherland, we should be remember here how they struggled, how they achieved a lot, how they sacrificed their life when finally we got a freedom. So we should be remember this is our own land, this is our motherland students. It will be forever ours. So long, longer days, we should be say we proud of our uh, motherland. That says uh, forever ours, it is our own native land. No nation shall enslave us again. Enslave, again, uh, uh, take uh, under control of our nation. There is no space. There is no way again to another foreigners to attack to our India and uh, made the, under the control of our India. It was no way. We will prosper serving God. We should be successful. Uh, serving God in the sense we should be remember our motherland. So our motherland we should be remember here, we should be worship here and uh, successful. We got when got a freedom. So our soul Lord, only our Lord, that is motherland, our worshipping Lord, we should be remember here. That is the successful we got here when we got a freedom. We should be remember the uh, completely joy, joyness, joyfulness, we say. Joyfulness, happy feelings, it completely expressed in this uh, poem when we got a freedom. So they didn't do any work, British. They did the administration and they swallow our complete uh, resource money. Finally, our strugglers, our freedom fighters uh, sacrificed their life. Finally, we got a freedom. We should be remember like this uh, sources inspiring to the Indians how we how uh, olden days uh, freedom fighters they struggle a lot here. I hope students uh, this poem, the song of freedom. When we got a freedom, the peoples how they felt happy, how they had happy, how they were singing a song, dancing. When we got a freedom, the complete concept explained in this. Uh, uh, poem students and uh, thank you students next class next uh, new lesson bye students